Aren't they great? So, Thanks for having me. Yeah, go ahead and do it. Aaron, Josh, tell us who you are. I'm Karen Watson. I am the president and founder of GOPBuzz.com. And I am the author of the book, Being Black and Republican in the Age of Obama. Oh, wonderful. Uh, what inspired you to write that book? I want people to realize that how important it is for the Republican Party to not be pigeonholed into the way the mainstream media has been branding it as the party of the old angry white male. Right. <laughs> but to let people know that it is a very open party and that there are a lot of reasons why someone would choose conservative values over, you know, the values of the left. Right. And Another question for you too. Uh, did you know? Uh, maybe you do know. This past week, uh, Nancy Pelosi called me a racist. Believe it or not, her 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 um, her staff called me a racist. What's your what? What do you? Was that the first time? I mean, <laughs> these people live on those kind of attacks. What happens is that that's the only. That's their only bullet that they have. Right. They don't have, they can't fight conservative values and what's going on under this administration with anything else. So they have to attack people with that hominid attack. You have to be considered racist. You have to be homophobic. You have right. to be sexist. Right. And that's what they're saying to do down at also they're teaching their kids down and um U, uh, USC too, as well as well as Stanford, as well as Harvard, they're docker, they're they're dockering these kids, saying that they're that the Republican Party is a racist party now. They're telling this, they're t they're they're telling this to to future to future broadcasters who are in college right now. They're dockering these kids. Please wait. It's actually just outrageous.